Sonny, what a career you've had. You've just announced your retirement. I mean, you've done it all. You've won it all. You've won the Rugby World Cup. You've won the titles in league. You've won the boxing belt. You've done it all. You really are one of the most incredible athletes the world's seen. But more importantly, you're one of the best people I've ever met. And a lot of people have felt the same. I've been asked to speak a little bit about what happened in 2015 and what's happened since. I mean, you changed my life back in 2015 when I made the irrational, some might say silly decision to run on the pitch. And I got tackled quite badly by security and you saw me on the floor and you picked me up. Whilst a lot of people may have walked past or just forgotten about it. You took me back to my family, you looked after me and you gave me this. Your winner's medal that you'd worked so hard for over the four years before to win. And you gave it to me. Because what's more important to you was always the memories, the enjoyment, the being on the pitch with the brothers and having millions of people watching you and being grateful for what the opportunities you've been given. And I remember I asked you that evening, I was like, do you want it back? Like, I feel bad that you've given it to me. And you said no, because you knew the happiness, the pictures of the smiles on my face that you'd given me and the enjoyment and what that meant to me and that the memories are always bigger to you. I mean, we won't forget the interview afterwards when you called me seven or eight and I was in fact 14, which was an interesting one going back to school. But I mean, I'll take it when you call me seven or eight and you gave me this, which really did change my life. And then over the last five, six years, we built an incredible relationship together where your kindness hasn't stopped ever. I mean, most recently we were in Japan for two months together whilst you were playing in the World Cup. You brought me into your family with your amazing four kids and wife and the rest of the crew, Koda and Tarek and the rest. You brought me in, you welcomed me in with all of them. And it was incredible. I mean, I never thought that we'd have this relationship, that I've had the, I would have this relationship with a global superstar, a rugby legend and a sporting legend, one of my heroes ever since I've grown up. And now I've got this personal relationship with you. I've seen an even better side of you. I mean, there's countless things of where I can list of how kind and generous you've been. But I mean, there's too many to list. But you, you changed my life. We've now set up our foundation together that hopefully over the years will change a lot of people's lives and help a lot of people. And I just think it's incredible and I want you to enjoy your retirement, have fun with it, have fun with your kids, the four kids, incredible kids and your incredible wife. Enjoy being back in the ring and hopefully I'll catch up soon when all of this COVID's over. Take care and enjoy the retirement, brother.